Director of Emergency Management adds that the damage from the sinkhole along 15 Mile and Hayes could get worse. So what's next? We're going to continue what we've been doing um, over the course of, of the past two weeks. Obviously, you still have contractors on site, employees. Um, you know, we're working closely with the state. Um, we're uh, continuing to collect uh, damage from the site and the area, getting our expenses together, uh, things of that nature. Meantime, separately, Clinton Township has declared a state of emergency because its supervisor says the damage from the sinkhole continues to affect a large number of residents. Reporting live, Summer Hooper, WWJ News Radio 950. We'll do this afternoon on WWJ. The frigid temperatures across Metro Detroit are actually perfect for this annual outdoor event in Oakland County. News Radio 950, Stephanie Davis is live and local in Rochester Hills with the story for us, Steph. Hey, good afternoon, Greg. It would be even better if there was some snow with this freezing weather. That is the thinking with Oakland County Health, uh, Oakland County officials uh, here this afternoon talking up their annual fire and ice festival set for later this month on the 20th through the 22nd here in Rochester Hills. This is our chance here to read the list of things that are going on here. There's something for everybody. And, uh, I can't think of anything that happens going in ice skating for the kids, dog sleds. These kids love dog sleds, right? They see them, but they never dreamed they'd ever have them. So it's 
a well-planned event. We had a big committee, and uh, uh, I just uh, like this. We're watching it.